Hey what's up everyone and welcome back to the channel and today we're here with a game called The Shopping List. Uh, this game is made by the same person that made the game that we played two days ago I think it was called Broken Through which I really enjoyed so I went to check if he had any other games and he did and it's called The Shopping List so my expectations are high for this one as well. Apparently someone is shopping people though because those were a lot of wanted uh, missing posters. Don't trust a stranger. Thanks, I won't. I'll make sure not to do that. Whoa! I'm really gonna miss my hometown. I hope moving to the city will give me more opportunities in life. More opportunities to die, probably. Oh man, I almost forgot. I have to finish my shopping list before I crash at my new apartment. Oh, Jesus, that's loud. <laughs> the shopping list. Another cool beginning from him. The other game had a cool beginning as well. He had the same lampposts in the game, actually. Press tab to check your shopping list. Press space to autoplay dialogues. Let the shopping begin. Hell yeah! Shopping list. Milk, grocery store, shampoo, body shop, toy, toy store, chocolate, toy store. Hmm, honestly, I could get used to living here. I just hope these stores are open at night. Uh, printer paper, flowers, and fresh meat. Alright, let's go into the first building. What's over here? Grocery store, yes. Whoa, this is nice. We need... Oh, I don't need milk, okay. Wake him up. What? Oh! <laughs> thought, he, thought he meant him. I was like, he looks pretty awake to me. Uh, well, let's not... Wake you up just yet. I need to get my milk first. Don't want to make, wake you up for no reason. Because what if you're out of milk? Oh, can't go here. Maybe we do have to wake him up. Doesn't seem like the milk area either. You know what? Fuck it. Let's just wake him up. Hello, sir. Ugh, ugh. Who the hell are you? Give your name. Christian. Oh, well, I guess we'll go with Chris, because Christian can't fit. Chris. <laughs> Chris? What a stupid name. What kind of weirdo would name you anyone something like that? Anyways, what can I do for you? I'm a... Uh, well, do you happen to know where the milk is? Fuck you, man. The milk? Yeah, it should be over by the soda and drinks area. If not, just come back here and I'll check the supply stock. Now leave me alone and let me rest. You seem to have some milk. Can I have yours? Guess not. Um, the sodas and drinks. This looks like... No. Can we walk further now? Yes, we can. Ah, there it is. Hey, dude. Speak to Toast. Sick name. Hey, do you work here? No, I don't. But, I'm actually hoping to get a job working here. Well, how's that working out for you? Not too good. <laughs> I got fired from a previous job at the tech store. Why? Why? Because they replaced me with a fucking machine. I'm sorry, but come on. And now people barely even shop there because they find the whole machine thing weird. Well, anyways. I'm going to continue to look busy so I can get this job. <laughs> Good luck shopping, I guess. Alright, bye. <laughs> bye, dude. Milk out of stock. What? Milk out of stock? You you hung up a whole sign for that? Alright, dude. Milk is out of stock. Wake him up again. Hello? 
So did you find what you're looking for? No, the milk is out of stock. I no worries. I'll take a look back here. All right, Jordan. Give the customer the milk. No, it's my milk. Jordan, no. If they want my milk, they gonna pay extra. All right, so you're gonna have to pay extra for the milk. <laughs> Let's be cheapskates. Fifteen. Fifteen point one. There you go. <laughs> hey, I'm sorry about before. Also, I get grumpy when I'm tired. I've barely gotten any sleep. You know, the dialogue's going pretty fast. The disappearances that have happened around here lately. You don't know? Well, just take my advice and finish the shopping of yours before it gets dark. Alright, bye-bye now. I wanted to say... <laughs> <laughs> I wanted to say, was I already paying extra? Because $15 for one milk seems insane. So I'm guessing I've, uh, I maybe already was paying extra and I just gave him extra extra. Well, can't do anything about it now. Shampoo, body shop, hello. Who are you? Hey, you! I'm gonna need to see some ID before I let you continue down this path. It's a strict security procedure that we have to follow after this week's latest events. Alright, Ruben. Now, get over here and enter your ID. Shit. I lost my ID before I came here. Well, I'm just not going there then. Because fuck you. Ah, uh, can't walk past you. Okay. Speak to Ruben. <laughs> you have a funny face. Head it over. Lie, lie, or lie. Hmm. I'm gonna have to think about this one. Let's, uh, let's do lie. Uh, I left my ID in the car. Just give me a minute and I'll be right back. Fine. Just hurry up, will ya? Also, my eyesight is really bad. So you better not do anything cheeky with a card now. Ah, maybe I can find something that looks like an ID card in the dumpster. Where was that dumpster? Right here, right? Yes. Search, dumpster. Oh, hold. I'm not doing anything weird, dude. Man. Oh, man, I could have just gotten milk from here. That would have been a deal in a steal. Missing poster. Because, uh... Don't maybe we can use that as an no. That looks like an ID card, Ruben. <laughs> ID card, Ru wait, that's his ID card. Sure, let's use that. All right, got my ID card. Took you long enough. Sorry about the delay, but I got what you wanted right here. Hmm. Yes, let's take a look here then. You sure this is you? It's a little blurry. They don't make them like this. Oh, what? Your eyes? Oh, right. No glasses. Hey, uh, you promised this is you on the card, right? Sure. Then piss off. <laughs> I could have been a murderer and you just... You have blood in your hands right now. If I was a murderer, which I'm not. But if I was... That's on you, man. Where's the body shot? Oh. Examine music box. This brings back memories. It just brings me back nightmares. That sounds awful. And why is it there in the middle of nowhere? Well, not the middle of nowhere, but like, why is it just there? 1975. He led her to his kingdom, where he was jo joyfully received. And they lived for a long time and afterwards, so happy and contented. Wow, wasn't that story exciting, sweetie? That was very good! <laughs> <laughs> You're so cute. I love you, sweetie. Love you too, mommy! <laughs> <laughs> Adding the little smiley faces to it is kind of cute. 
Huh? It felt like it was turning me around, like... And I didn't do it, but okay. Body shop. I love your booty. Why? <laughs> me too. Hey, Aggie. What's up? Oh my god, like, hi. Welcome to the, like, body shop or whatever. How can I help you? Hi, well, I just need some ordinary shampoo. Anything is fine, really. Anything? Um, yeah. Great. We only have three shampoos left, which is superb, since you'll have any shampoo, right? Yeah. Oh my god, great. No one has bought them in like two years or something. Don't know why. I think they are great. You can choose between Gusto Greasy Gramps, Scott Saucy Shem the Poo, and Basic Strawberry Shampoo. I mean, is it even a choice? It's clearly Shem the Poo. Ah, the Scott Saucy Shem the Poo? Great choice. Hmm? You seem unsure of buying it. Alright, you can try it out but for, for free in the public shower that we have in the back. Come back here after you're done. Bye! <laughs> Bye. Right, let me try it. Restroom. I'm gonna be smelling like the freshest shit there's ever been. Yes. This shampoo smells like shit, but in a good way. <laughs> I've never felt this dirty while taking a shower before. But I've already committed to this one. I guess this is what I smell like the next couple of what I'll smell like the next couple of weeks. Hey, it's only a strategy, man. You don't know it, but you're in a horror game. And the worse we smell, the less likely we are to be killed by a murderer. Because even a murderer wouldn't want to fuck, fuck with us now because of the smell. Alright. Give me this one. So, what you think? Are you gonna buy it? I can't. Well, finally! I mean, great! That would be $9.99. <laughs> yes, uh, keep the change. Thank you for your purchase. I'm surprised that you're out shopping this late. Everyone is, apparently. We barely get any customers at this time of the day because of, because of the disappearances, I know. The disappearances. The only ones that have been here today are you and some creep that looked at me through the glass window while you were showering. Meh, that doesn't matter really. Just be careful out there for me. It's not safe being out at this time. Right. Thanks. Bye. Oh, wow, that's an atmosphere change and a half. Holy shit. Uh, a toy. Right, let's get a toy. Just get the music box. That's... I'm sure a kid can have a lot of fun with that. Oh, wait, or maybe it's a different kind of toy. Shouldn't make presumptions. Oh, man. Uh-oh. That's blood, I think. Timmy's Toys. Yeah, this looks like a lovely toy store. I hope... Or maybe it's a different kind of toys. I'm guessing it's a different kind. Oh! Wait, is it? <laughs> I'm not sure. <laughs> Could be both. Could be Speak to Timmy. Jesus, Timmy. <laughs> Minmo cat food. But you look fucked up, man. What kind of store is this? Uh, hey. Huh? How can I help you? Well, I was looking for something cute to put in my new apartment. You got any toy or stuffed animals you could recommend? I'd also like a chocolate bar. Chocolate? I... Hmm. Let me take a look in these boxes. Meanwhile, you could do something for me. I'm sorry, I'm a bit of a rush. I don't think I can. If you want my help, you better help me back. Times have been busy lately. 
<sighs> All right, what do you want me to do? You know that amusement sign by the entrance? It's supposed to be glowing, but the wires are all messed up, so I want you to check them out. Fine. I'm no mechanic. What kind of service is this? Wait, can I? Oh. Oh, wait, this one. <laughs> I thought you meant outside. What? You are asking a little bit too much of me, pal. Uh, right? Like that? Yes. Bing. Boom. There we go. Wow. <laughs> you actually managed to rewire it? I sure did. I'm amazing. Well, a deal's a deal. Here's your stuff. Thanks. Hey, I have a quick question. Everyone I've talked to today has warned me about the dangers of being out this, at this time. Is it really that dangerous for me to be out right now? Don't listen to them. People don't like when new people come into this town. So they just try to scare them away with the usual reason. There's a killer on the loose, blah, blah, blah. It's just proper bullshit. Just ignore them and move on. Alright, bye now. I've got the feeling it's not bullshit and you're the killer. I wouldn't be surprised, because you look fucked up and what is this store? Man. Right, I'm glad that's over. Uh, toy and chocolate is done now. All right, printer paper from the tech store. I heard something. I don't know what, but heard it again. Right, let's uh, let's be safe now. Very safe. I'm guessing that's another store. Or another music box. A rose. This brings back memories. Why does everything bring back memories for you? <laughs> ah. I'm gonna miss you. I love you, Mom. Oh, that's sad, man. Especially after the other uh, flashback we had with her reading us a story. Ain't the world just cruel? Oh, more dumpster diving, yes! Oh, no. Guess not. The tech store should be close by. How about you just go in the morning? You know, is it really that serious to get all of this stuff right now? Ah, the tech store to hell. Right. Looks like a lovely place from the outside. What the? Is that a naked bend over man? Oh, it's a mannequin. Oh, activate, activate Android. Hey, Carl! Wow, ain't technology just something? Alright, because the guy lost his job to this guy. You, you said that. Poor guy at the uh, grocery shop lost his uh, job to Carl. Carl, Coral, <laughs> uh, printing paper. Order complete. Uh, yeah, yep, will do. I mean, he's a stupid android. I'm gonna. Oh. Fine, but I'm giving you the bare minimum, you 
Android. It's great. And he goes back to bending over. Anything else in this store? Any secrets? No. All right, you go back to bending over for customers. I mean, pretty handy, I guess, if it's open 24 seven, almost finished. But I'd still prefer being at a human, I think. At least have some human interaction. Flowers, florist, yes. What? I can't, I can't look at my shopping list anymore. What's happening? This looks like one of those alleyways in Gotham City. Oh my god, that scared the shit out of me. Let's walk towards it. <laughs> yeah. I'm sure that's just a florist trying to give us some flowers. Great service. He knows what I'm gonna buy before I even tell him. I do not like this. Alright, a little faster now. Yes, pick up the pace. Just want to get some flowers. Oh. Missing poster. Ashton Garcia, reward 20... Uh, 1,200. Please find my little boy. Uh, well, this place seems off. I don't think I'll be able to... F Maybe I'll find your little boy because I'll be with your little boy very soon because I'll probably get murdered. That's the kind of vibe I'm getting. Closed road. Well, vaulted. Yeah. <laughs> Where is this florist, huh? And you have to walk all the way back? It's not worth it, man. No. Yeah, is that the murderer? I've got my eye on you. Uh, right, I'm not sure this door is locked. Well, just... It should be open. The owner is probably taking a break or something. I'll keep an eye out. I have a feeling this is the owner's bicycle. She must be in the store. I'll just knock, I guess. Hello? Hello? Get the fuck out of here! Hey, what's your problem? Leave my family the fuck alone! Take whatever you want, just don't hurt us! I'll just grab this rose then. Free rose! You could've grabbed the other one. That was already... There. Come on. I'll end up spook I'll end up soaking wet before I get to the town's butcher. Hey! What are you doing out here in the pouring rain at this time? I could take you where you are headed. No! Just get in the car and I'll take you wherever. Nope! I could do with some company. You are not dumb enough! Obviously not! No! No, it's okay. I'll just walk. No! Don't worry, it's not a big deal. Besides, you don't want to get your clothes wet now, do ya? I prefer getting my clothes wet- Alright, what? No! No. Get out! Oh, come on. You've just heard about people going missing and being murdered. And at the first opportunity you get to jump in a stranger's car, it's great. Oh wait, it's Ruben! Hey, wait a minute. You're that goofy motherfucker from before. 
Oh, what's up, Ruben? Wait, how do you know my name? From your ID? Oops. Ah, awkward. Anyways, so where are you heading? I'm heading to the butcher down by the community park. Splendid. Well then, let's get a move on. Something is telling me there's gonna be other kinds of different fresh meats. It's just around the corner, so it'll be a short drive. Alright, thanks. Oh, what the... Oh, there's that car again! Right, Ruben, there uh, seems to be a car following us, buddy. You're a police officer, right? Where's your gun? Give it to me. Is he gonna... Okay, I thought he was gonna do a hit and run thing. Like, bump into the back of our car? I'm watching you, yeah. Well, here we are. Usually I charge for rides like this, but I'll spare you from payment. Anyways, I guess I'll see you around. Have a good one. Thanks, Ruben. I guess sometimes strangers can be nice, but I'd still think it's a mistake that you accepted the ride. Bastard butchery? Yeah, that's what that says. I gotta say though, man, this guy makes like very high quality games. Hello, welcome to Bastard Butchery. Don't be shy, have a look around. We have all kinds of meat. Meet me by the counter if you need help making up your mind. Alright, sounds good. That probably wasn't even a pun, but I just thought... Yeah, meat, meat. <laughs> uh, ooh, wow, look at these beauties. I can smell how rotten this is through the glass. Oh, never mind, you're not. Not quite beauties, I suppose. Have you made up your mind? Not really. I was hoping to ask you for your recommendation. Oh, well, personally, my fa- What the hell? The power never goes out in this area. Oh my god. I'm busy as fuck, I don't have time to replace fuses, goddammit. Hey. I'll give you the meat for free if you go back in my storage room and replace the fuses. No. I left some spare fuses. I left some spare ones scattered around. Yeah, sure, I could do that. Why? All right, cool. I'll wait here. Here's a flashlight. It gets dark in there. Date E knows I'm gonna get murdered. You need three fuses. Once that is done, you just need to flip the switch by the fuse box. Thanks for the help. No problem, man. Is this how you get your fresh meat? Huh? How do I turn it on? Ah, F. Man, I don't want, I don't want to be fresh meat. Here we are. What if Ruben is working together with him? Oh, I don't like searching around, especially not in the dark. All right, so here's the fuse box. We'll remember that. Fuse, great. Easy. Two more to go. Let's put that in already. Oh, I guess we can't. Man, you weren't kidding. It really gets dark. Uh, this way. Oh, I don't like this. Someone's gonna jump out. Examine the bottle. This brings back memories. Ah, yes, the great memories of being an alcoholic. How could I ever forget? 
Dad. You monstrous fuck. You selfish drunk. Mom, or, mom never did en you any harm. Neither did I. Both you and I know mom killed herself because of you. Jesus. You ruined everything, you alcoholic fuck. I never want to see you see or hear from you again. I don't want to associate with you one bit. Fuck me. I even lie about my name to move on from you. Chris? Who the fuck is that even? Rather than having that carry the name you gave me. Claire. I didn't even tell my friends my real name. I hope you rot in hell, Dad. Uh-oh. I hope it's not my ja dad chasing us. Dad's coming back to haunt us and kill us. Why do I have the feeling that the guy is going to be missing once we put the fuses in and we go back? And flip the switch. Yes. There we go. I'm sure he'll still be here and everything will be fine. I'll actually be very surprised if that is the case, but... Holy fuck! Yep, that's what I thought. Uh-oh. Well, that is some fresh meat. I'm just glad it wasn't me. I have to call the police. Yes, let's do that. Let's call our old pal Ruben. And make sure he gets back here. Ruben's on the case. Look around while we're calling. The phone lost connection. Oh, of course it did. I need to hide. Where? No! No! Oh, fuck! Oh, let's get the shit out of me! Go! Go, 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 go! How does that fly? <laughs> get away! Shoot! Come here and I'll blind you with my flashlight. I'm not kidding around. I'll fuck you up, man. I have to get to my car. That's like a million miles away. I have to sneak into one of these buildings and exit through the back without making too much noise. Alright, let's do that. This is so loud. Okay. Okay, we're inside the building. I just have to make my way to the opposite side of the building. Yes, let's do that. Surely it won't be that easy. Can we go in the elevator? Oh shit. Oh, we're dead. We are dead. Alright, I don't see anything. But that's also because it's very dark, so I'm literally not seeing anything right now. I don't want to turn off my flashlight in case he can see me. Storage. Maybe I can find something of use in the storage room. I uh, sure hope so. Close it. 
child's note. Dad told me to hide here in the storage room. I don't know why he is so panicked. I hope he'll be back soon. It's cold in here. Right, yeah, that's useful. I'm glad I went in here. Is there nothing in here? And we're just gonna walk out and get fucked. One way to find out, Nero! Okay. Can't go there. Oh. It's him. Yup. Yup. Don't look behind you. Just go. Just go. Go. I can't go back now. Yup. The fuck you can. Basement. Sure. Yup. Why not? Go into the depths of hell. Yup. Okay, just wait around the corner and bash him on the head. I do kickboxing, man. I'll kick your ass. I swear to God. <laughs> Unless you have a knife. Then I'll probably get my shit stabbed the fuck out of me. You know what? Scrap what I said. I, I, no. I wasn't threatening you. My bad. Ah, lovely. Are those the missing people? Oh my god. I recognize these people. They're from the posters. They moved into the city to work at this company. They were the only ones that had night shifts. Now they are dead. With a toy knife left on the crime scene? I need to get the fuck out of here. Yes, gladly. Ah, oh, you guys look fucked up, man. Don't jump out of the... Oh, whack-a-mole, you're a shit if you jump out of one of those. Right. I'm sure we're gonna be safe here now. What is this? Inspect map. Great map. This is the same area where I entered this town from. What? I never noticed the gas station on the map. I must have missed it while walking into the town. Nope. My car should not be too far away from the gas station. I should check if anyone's working there in a convenience store. I need someone to call the cops and it might be able to get some gas from the car. I just have to follow the path up and then walk into the woods. The gas station should be on the other side. Something telling me there's not a gas station there and just walking towards your death. More like a death station. <laughs> Bad joke. There should be a path I can take in the woods at the end of this walkway. Yep, I'm sure. I'm sure there will be. Yeah, probably uh, an animal, right? Yeah. We're so dead. Just like that, it's turned into Slender Man. You wanna go collect 8 pages too, huh? While you're at it? With your stupid shopping list? Just go shopping in the morning, afternoon, close to night, not midnight, what is this man? And you just kept going after people told you people have gone missing. I'm more surprised at the fact that there's actually a gas station here than at the fact that we are still alive.
All right. Is there going to be people inside? Oh, man. Am I... Is it good to see you? Well, that's your the creep. Because probably. Jake For Forster. Oh, thank God. I need your help right fucking now. This is guy following me and I've seen dead bodies everywhere and I'm... Whoa, whoa, whoa. Order horses there, Bucky. What's your name? Oh. We get a choice here. So it's either gonna be... Mmm. Well, she didn't want to associate with her dad, but like, if this is her, her dad, she might piss him the fuck off and he might kill us. Fuck. <laughs> Shit, wait, let me think, let me think about this. I think I'm just gonna go with Chris, cause fuck the dad. Keep defying him. Chris. Right then. What can I do for you? I just told you. I need you to call the police right now. I'm being stalled by a killer as we speak. Ha! <laughs> Nice try there, buddy. I know that y'all people are just trying to scare us outsiders because y'all don't like newcomers in this town. This is not a fucking joke. There's a literal evidence. There's literal evidence all around over this place. Really? Yes. Well, if you're so confident, then prove it. Take this camera and photograph one single piece of evidence. Show him the photo when you get back. Okay. Free camera! Tap to go into camera mode. Whoa! Let's just play in this. Pretty sick. I think I saw a missing poster by the right sidewalk. Where? Right here? Ah, yeah. Alright, let's get a nice picture of that. There we go. And the next piece of evidence is gonna be your dead body in that store, because you're probably dead now. I'll still take a picture of you and show it to your dead corpse, though, if you want, huh? If that's enough evidence for you, stupid bitch. Just call the police when someone asks, man. You're not the guy from before, or Oh, wait. Oh, wait, you are. Jake Forrester. Yes. Here's your evidence. I believe you. I believe you. I've called the police already. I saw him by the window. You need to leave right now. If you need anything, just grab it and get out. I need to refuel my car. Can I get a jerry can or something like that? Yeah, sure. You can fill it up by the pumps outside. Please be careful. Just stay inside together. Oh, man. Just stay inside together. Hide. Two against one. Hold E, fill up Jerry can, yes. Okay, what now? Oh, can we actually go behind? Okay, no. Right, where do we go now? Oh, I'm stupid, I just need to pick up the Jerry can. I have to follow the path behind the gas station to get to my car. Oh, come on. Oh, not this way, I guess. Other side. Path behind the gas station? Well, let me get behind there then. Maybe this way? Ah, this way, yeah. That's not behind the gas station, though. That's right next to it. We're gonna die. 
Is that the police? Ah, Ruben is dead. I repeat, Ruben is down. Uh, is that my car? I sure hope not. It is. Are you not commenting on how fucked up it looks? Couldn't we have just taken a police car and said that looked like a, a lot nicer? Poor Ruben. Have you checked in the back seat of the car? What if he's in there? Check inside of the car, please! Why is my car slowing down? Oh, I'm not sure if I want to exit my vehicle. Well, stupid car. My tar tires have been slashed. I'm really close to my apartment, though, so I should be able to drive to the last. I should be able to drive the last bit. Oh wait, so you're getting back in your car? I thought I read that wrong, and I got confused. Yeah, just drive with the slash tires. Again, check your back seat first, please. But, okay. Make cereal. Lovely shower. Is he gonna climb over into my balcony? Lovely place. Right, let's make some cereal. Don't you have a phone here at home? Shouldn't you call the police again? Did you just pour the milk first and the cereal second? We're the real psychopath. <gasps> we killed everyone. That's the plot twist, because no normal person pours the milk first, come on. That's just a crime. Take a shower. Why is the music like this? At least let me have one final shower before you shank me to death. Oh no. Oh. Turn on the news. Yeah, let's turn on the news. Let's check if there's anyone in my home first, though. Seems to be clear. Police officer Ruben has been confirmed dead. He was earlier this evening found by the gas station near Community Park with three stab wounds in the chest and two by the neck. Yep. The police have searched the area but have not found any more evidence to who could be the murderer. Go to bed. This kinda sucks. Can't you do close this? No. I'm not opening. Go to bed. No. Why? 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 Jump out! Jump out from the balcony! You best better not open that fucking door. You shouldn't even get close to it. What if he shoots through the door? Check people.
I knew it. I knew he was going to be behind me. You're just like your mother. Goodbye, Claire. Oh my god, I'm ashamed to call him my father. After everything he did to my mom. And doing it all without a care in the world. He didn't give a shit about anyone. Then he started drinking. He started doing drugs, which made him lose hair. Which made him lose hair. After mom's death, and after non-stop abuse, I took dad's car and drove off. After a few years of therapy, I could handle the trauma, and I even forgot about those memories. Dad hated me. He used to explain in great detail how much he hated my guts after mom's death. After his drug abuse, he looked 40 years older. I barely even recognized him in that toy store. Oh! He moved into the city before me and took out his stress on the locals. But he never got caught. Man. So it was him in the toy store. I knew it. Well, I didn't know that was him, but I knew he was the murderer. There was something uh, wrong with that guy. The shopping list. Oh man, another banger from this guy. I don't know if this guy has any more games, but if he does, and if he ever brings out more games again, I'll definitely play them. Because this was also very, very good again. God, man, the atmosphere building here was tense as shit. Very, very, very cool. Very well done. Ruben as some random dude, he was more than that. He was a hero to us all. An inspiration. He will be deeply missed. Based on my mother's fear of being stalked while shopping. Oh. <laughs> cool. I, I like it when... Uh, People use, like, real-life inspiration for their games. Alright, guys. Well, that was the shopping list. Um, I can't, I'm kind of curious if there's, like, a different ending if you say your name is Claire at the end. But I don't think that really matters. Maybe it does. But I don't really feel like going through the entire game again just to do that option differently, I guess. But, yeah. I hope you guys enjoyed watching this video. I'm actually going to be playing uh, some games that you rec guys recommended soon. Because in the comments, I saw someone recommended like a few games, so I'll definitely just check those out and maybe make a video on them. But yeah, if you guys want to see more, please consider liking and subscribing, and I'll see you guys in the next video. Peace.